This is the model that we are going to test as part of this illustration. Now we expect collaborative culture to mediate between vision and organizational performance. So we've got a very simple model. To begin with mediation analysis, we need to ensure that all constructs are reliable and valid and that the structural model meets all the quality criteria as we have just discussed. Now, as we have conducted these evaluations in the previous session, we can now directly move to the mediation analysis. Now, you have to refer back to the previous session on evaluating your reflective model or formative model and evaluation of your structural model. In this session, we are going to focus on mediation analysis. Now, the first step is to test for significance of the relevant indirect effects, whether the influence of vision on organizational performance through collaborative culture is significant or not. This is the first step. That is your P1 and P2 are significant or not. To test for significance of these path coefficients, we first need to estimate and bootstrap the model and summarize the results. So we are going to use the same procedure till bootstrapping the results and getting the summary out of those results. Now what's the code? Again, we load our data, we specify our measurement model, we create our structural model, again vision to organizational performance that is your direct effect, vision to collaborative culture, IV to mediator and then collaborative culture to organizational performance that is your mediator to your dependent variable. Just the three parts as identified in the last slide. Now estimate your model, the measurement model. Now summarize the results and put them in this summary object. Check for the iterations and they should not be over 300 and then bootstrap your model. What do you want to bootstrap? You want to bootstrap your estimated model simple underscore model and these are the properties i'm going to set and then put the summary of the bootstrapped model into summary underscore boot and then we will do our mediation but before that let's run our code so i'm just going to run this code here i'm going to select it all here and copy i've, I've got it here but let me run it again so that if there are any errors we can correct them and let's select it all, run it. Now let's have a look at the previous. Okay, there is no issue. Okay, so there are no issues. Let's see what we get in our bootstrapping model sem in R. Okay, and it did run successfully. And now we have got our results in summary underscore boot. And we've got our results in summary underscore simple. So next step, let's do our next step. So this is the illustration. Let's briefly discuss this. Now the results of total indirect effects can be found in inspecting total indirect effects element within the summary underscore model object, summary underscore model and total indirect effects. Now the first step is to assess whether or not your indirect effects are significant or not. So where are your indirect effects? They are in summary underscore model object. So where is it? Let's have a look. So I'm just going to copy this here. And this is going to give me the total indirect effects. Now this is just fine when you've got one mediator. But if you've got more than one mediator, we need specific indirect effects. But we are going to look into that later as well. So let's run this run it and look at this here so the indirect effect from vision to organizational performance is 0.165 but is it significant now my interest is in assessing whether this effect is significant or not now since we had only one mediator so we've got only one indirect effect from vision to organizational performance you are going to have multiple examples with multiple mediators as well so how do you assess these specific indirect effects now, this was the total effect. In this case, the total effect, total indirect effect and the specific indirect effect would be the same. But in case you've got multiple mediators, then there are different effects. Now, specific indirect effects will take these arguments here. So this is the model, boot underscore model, that is boot underscore seminar underscore model, then comma, then your exogenous variable, then your mediator, then your dependent variable and then your alpha value. So how do you check it? Let's come back here. In this case, we only had one mediator. So we're just going to put it in 
okay it's better to write it like this when you okay do not put in too much spaces now specific indirect effect or specific effects significance and that is for which model bootstrapped model now this is your bootstrapped model and now it is from vision to collaborative culture to organizational performance where collaborative culture is your mediator that is identified through this argument let's run it now look at this is this effect indirect effect significant yes it's significant it is greater than 1.96 and look at this there is no zero in between so we can say yes collaborative culture mediates between vision and organizational performance now that we know that your indirect effect is significant now the next step is to identify whether the direct effects were significant or not in order to assess whether or not the mediation was complete or partial so let's briefly discuss this theory now following the mediation analysis procedure we can now ascertain if the direct effect is significant for mediation effect that is whether or not the mediation is partial or complete or full mediation so in order to do this now that we know that the indirect effect is significant we now need to know whether the direct effect that is from vision to organizational performance was significant or not now if both paths are significant this is partial mediation however if the direct path is insignificant this is full mediation so how do we do this let's run it let's copy this so the first step is your indirect effect which was significant now let's have a look at this the direct path let's see let's run it so the direct effect from vision to organizational performance is this is it significant now let's look at the bootstrap parts from bootstrap model summary vision to organizational performance well it is significant there is no zero in between now look at the path 0.479 quite good look at the t statistics yes it is significant now if we have a look the indirect effect here it is was significant look at this the direct path is significant so both your direct effect and indirect effects are significant so this is partial mediation 